Damn it, I'm about to win 100K. I'm about to win six figs. Oh my goodness, look at this. Yo, let's go. We're about to head out to Dublin, uh, getting packed up here, and I'm excited. Um, <laughs> a little bit nervous as well, you know. Uh, a lot of traveling. It's a long time away from the family, kids, and stuff like that. Getting everything together here, packed up. Got the camera equipment, book bag. Let's get it. About to board our flight. Here we go. What up guys, we just got to the hotel from uh, the airport. Wanted to show you guys around. We're staying at the Intercontinental, it's beautiful. We did it, baby. Uh, here is our room for the week. And it's really nice. Some complimentary stuff we got down here. The good stuff, hey. We got a lot of space in here, man. This is what I need. I love this room. <laughs> uh, so we are firmly here. We're in Dublin, we're chilling, we're good to go. Yeah, I think tomorrow when I get rested up, my plan is to start uh, working a little bit, studying a little bit and uh, try to stay sharp for the tournament. I think I'm gonna play day 1A. So uh, with that being said, yeah, I'm gonna put in a little work tomorrow, try to work out, get a good night's rest. Uh, but we're here, baby, it feels good. Hey, welcome to Dublin. Come in, let's go. Hanging out, just ate breakfast, feeling great. Rocking the ignition. These new ignition patches, which I love, by the way, and I'm very appreciative to Ignition for the opportunity, dude. I can't even believe it's real. We've been working together for a long time and I genuinely appreciate the opportunity. Ignition is sick and we're gonna rep it and hopefully ship it today. <laughs> so uh, yeah, just sitting here studying, getting it in, man, and um, kind of cram session in before this tournament. At this buy-in level, you know, I've played a bunch of, or a few 1Ks, some. 5Ks, I played the main event. And uh, live poker is a bit different than uh, online and people tend to be a little bit more loose passive, which means they want to see more flops for a cheaper price, not aggressive, not three betting, not four betting enough, where I'm kind of the opposite. I'm a more of an aggressive player um, in some of these situations. So kind of getting used to making the adjustments towards more passive players. Woo, I'm already starting to sweat. Oh, let's go. <laughs> God damn it. I'm about to win 100K. I'm about to win six figs. Can you believe it? I'm calling my shot early. Why not, right? Let's go. Ah. Oh. So I think it's like a 10 minute walk or so. But yeah, this is pretty cool, man. I'm loving Dublin, by the way. I think the city is beautiful. Beers are definitely flowing <laughs> everywhere. There's uh, a lot of good drinking options around and everything like that, so it's pretty cool. Um, it's kind of crazy to be here, you know? Uh, I started out playing poker in college. I think I literally was playing like one cent, two cent. <laughs> and I uh, started with like a $7 bankroll. So we eventually started moving up, uh, won a couple little small tournaments back in the day. But, um, I was one of the victims of Black Friday. You know, I played for a living for about seven years, six, seven years, uh, pre-Black Friday. It was a little tough, you know. Uh, I didn't really find any work or anything. Uh, after the Black Friday happened, it was really tough because apparently having poker on your resume only is quite difficult. So uh, yeah, I got into real estate. I was a real estate agent for 10 years. Um, Loved it, man. I probably sold over 100 homes. I've managed about 140, 150 properties at points, built a property management 
company with a buddy of mine. Um, but I kind of got back into poker, you know, uh, I won a seat to the main event via just some home game series that we used to play. And that kind of led me to falling back in love with the game, getting back to studying. And I started with a couple hundred dollars on a few sites. Ignition was like one of the first sites uh, I deposited on. Uh, I loved Ignition. I've been playing on it since day one of my return and I uh, was able to build a bankroll from there. And since then, you know, I've been streaming for five years. I feel like I've won damn near every tournament on Ignition. I've had a lot of success. Um, my stream is growing and uh, I feel very fortunate for all the opportunities and I feel like the best is yet to come. Yeah, man, but thinking about the poker journey is getting me kind of, not emotional, but damn, it's like, ah, man, I've been playing poker since 2006, 2005 in college. And here we are in 2023 and I'm still in the game, and uh, now I have a young family. I have a beautiful wife who supports me doing this, two beautiful children. So, you know, I just want to keep trying to level up and uh, do great things and uh, let people who know, like, who lost things Black Friday or who have young families know that you can still pursue um, poker as, as a hobby or as, as a job. I mean, I just want to be an inspiration of people who love the game, right? Oh my goodness, look at this. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. This is sick, dude. This looks really cool. I wonder how many tables in here. 92, 93? I mean, it's over 100 tables in here. Let's go find out where we register. Is the cages, the buy in in there? Yeah. All right, thanks. Yeah, it's going all right. Um, we are up to about 69,500 uh, from 30,000. Honestly, it's been kind of crazy. Um, I was a little wrong in my reads earlier. I think before when I was talking about what I expected uh, from the player pool, maybe a lot of limping in multi-way spots where there wasn't as much limping and there was a lot of uh, multi-way aggression and a lot of aggression, uh, three bets. Uh, calling three bets. So there were a lot of big pots, um, but I seemed to navigate it pretty well. I had a spot in which I hit the nut flush um, in a multi-way spot and got it all in with the guy versus the straight. So we went a pretty big pot there and then just started to pick up a little, a couple small pots and picking off bluffs and stuff like that. Not really needing to risk really big pots. Um, so yeah, it's been a great start. I'm feeling super good and super comfortable. Yeah, I'm looking forward to finishing the day strong. I believe we have five more levels so we still got a long haul to go we're gonna finish tonight about 1 a.m so it's gonna be pretty tough but um yeah endurance um staying strong mentally and all that stuff so i'm pumped up uh i've been training for this What's up guys, this is a um, quick update. I didn't, we played the main yesterday. I didn't have an opportunity. I was so tired afterwards. I didn't like update here or anything like that, but we did make day two. Um, I'm not gonna say I'm particularly uh, super happy with uh, how I played considering we had a higher peak than what we finished with. Um, that won't always be, you know, uh, a fault of your own. Sometimes you can get luck, unlucky. Sometimes you can go card dead. But I do feel like there was a few opportunities uh, that I could have picked up chips, been more active in situations. But just, you know, uh, things happen. Uh, but I want to talk about that. I took a lot of notes on hands and things like that. But the good news is it's poker and um, we still have like 30 big blinds coming back to day two. We have a ton of play. Did do some things well, had a great time. And uh, yeah, we did it May day two. That's that's the important part, right? As long as you're still in, you have a chance. So, you know, uh, the poker is done for now. We got a couple days off and play the main event again in a few days. And we're gonna go check out City Center, do some fun stuff. We have the ignition party tonight. So we're gonna be going around town, showing you guys some of that. We are about to take the train for the first time. So we'll see what that's about. Oh, 
being in the front, like it's different. I'm like, keep putting my hands out in front of me and like, <laughs> <laughs> We stopped at this beautiful church bar. You gotta see this place, it is absolutely stunning. I mean, I've never seen anything like it. Uh, so yeah, we played all day yesterday. We're gonna have this day off, of course, and we're gonna go from here to the ignition party. Just wanted to do some sightseeing today and check some stuff out, but having a great time. And uh, yeah, I'm glad ignition tipped me out here, man. This is awesome. What's up guys, we are here at the Ignition player meet and greet. Everybody here uh, who's won a package is here, uh, invited to this party. So we're gonna go up, meet some people, have some beer, have some food, have a good time. Let's go get it. I, I, I give hugs here, how are you doing? You won a package as well? Hey, let's go. Have you uh, played in Europe before? No. So, same here for me. What's different from the states that I warned you about, people aren't multi-way lint pots. It's a lot of rays in a bunch of calls. Uh, I just wanted to say thank you to everybody for showing up. Uh, we just appreciate you here at Ignition, so it's great. Um, and I just wanted to do a quick salute. Salute, cheers. Cheers, yeah! Woo! What up guys, it is day six here in Dublin. Um, had the ignition party last night. Man, what a crazy good time. They made me Irish dance for fuck's sake, so. Uh, <laughs> ah! uh, we'll see about that, how that comes out. Uh, hopefully you guys don't make too much fun of me. <laughs> no, it was an uh, awesome experience. And uh, today, the plan is since we play tomorrow, try to maybe do a little bit more sightseeing. I'm actually gonna go down to the gym, try to sweat out some stuff. Um, get some good meal in today. And I may try to go to uh, a rugby match tonight. I mean, that's gonna be a hell of a time. We are here day two. Uh, we made the first break. We're sitting with like 28K or something like that uh, at one, two, going heading into one, two. Very happy with the play, even though we haven't had much or doubled up or anything like that. I've been super, I've been reasonable. You know, I've been aggressive, taking every spot, bunch of rejams, stuff like that. Um, so I'm pretty happy with my play today, uh, considering we haven't really chipped up or anything, but. It's not always about that. I'm um, having a great time. I'm doing the best that I can with the hands that were dealt and it's going well, man. Um, so maybe we can find a little heat, one double up, buy some time and stick around. So there's like 800 players or so left. Um, we started today with like a thousand. So we lost about a quarter of the field. Um, but yeah, man, uh, I'm very happy with how we're playing today. So it's good. All right, what up guys? We just busted the uh, IPO main event, which sucks, it feels really bad. Um, I had about 15 big blinds uh, after the second break, 
and we ran pocket queens into pocket kings. Someone opened under the gun, uh, actually under the gun, and I was like in mid middle position. Uh, went all in for like 15 big blinds with pocket queens, and the player behind woke up with kings. So feels a little bad. It is what it is. Um, but yeah, today's recap was you know, we came into the day. Pretty short stack uh, relative to everyone else. Literally lost the first five I played just to raise fold and got pretty short uh, at some points. Um, and then I get, uh, found a massive double up with ace king uh, a couple hours in and I tripled up and had a shot, you know, the queen spot goes well. We're at about 40 big blinds. So, uh, you know, not getting cooler, winning flips, you near the need to run good and be lucky in poker tournaments, but I'm extremely, proud of myself so uh, I'm looking forward to going uh, over that with you guys one day and you know this is all about building experience it was a great it was so much experience I feel like I played really well I love this game and uh, I met so many cool people and I just want to keep doing it and get better so you know I met um, so many amazing people here had a great time one of the best uh, uh, live experiences in my life uh, for poker and you know, um, got some compliments on my game and it, it was just great, you know, so IPO is over. Uh, we busted about a hundred away with queens to kings and that's poker, right?